Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can create a track order page for your Shopify store. So this page will help your customers to track their products when you are delivering them. So I have actually two types of pages over here. You can see on my screen that I have this latest design uh, and you can see that I have different colors of border and button color. So you can also modify according to your theme uh, color schema. And in the previous video, actually I have uh, a complete tutorial on how to create a Shopify store and all the things I have covered in that. And over there I made a video uh, in which the page uh, uh, for the track order page was uh, this type of having this type of design but in this video I will be showing you that how you can upgrade the design to this one alright so let me show you how you will be doing that so first of all you need to go to your dashboard of your Shopify store and here you can see that we have online store so if you will see on my store you will uh, get the home page something like this so similar type of uh, store I have created in in the previous video alright so if you have not watched the video, I will be adding the link below in the description. So you should watch that video as well. So here you can see that I have these themes and I need to click on pages here. Once you are clicking on pages, then we are interested to create a new page. Actually, I have deleted these pages because uh, now I am interested to uh, write the code once again. So here you need to click on add page. And here you have to write track order so for example yeah track order and now I need to add the code down below but before that I have uh, let me tell you I have already uh, added the link below in the description so you should click on that link and you will be redirected to the page from where you can copy the course, uh, code and then paste it over here alright so let me copy that code from here I have this link which I have added already below in the description so I need to open this link once again and in the link I have to fill a form you should click on submit button and you will be getting these links so you can see that I have uh, two codes for the track order so let me implement the first one first of all so I have opened that link in the new tab and you can see that I have this code so I'm going to copy this whole bunch of code from here let me copy this and then after I'm going to paste it over here but make sure that you should click over here show HTML alright then after you should paste that code over here I have pasted that code and let me click on save now if you will click on view on your online store then you will be getting this specific page so that means the code I have implemented is working fine so let me show you the tracking order detail of a specific product so I have a dummy uh, I mean older tracking number so that product is already delivered but let me show you how it will be working here alright so I have pasted that tracking number and let me click on track so once I will be clicking on track then the details would be showing below so you can see here that I have this uh, product uh, tracking number then this is delivered already from United States and these are the dates and accordingly the, the locations are going to be changed alright so this was the first page that I have created just now let me create another uh, type of store uh, I mean another type of tracking uh, page so for that again I have the track order title here and let me create another page so that I could separate it out but you can replace this uh, code as well so I'm going to create another page so track order latest alright so I need to paste the code here so let me go to uh, this form so again I'm going to uh, open in new tab so here you can see that the code has been uh, displayed here so you should again copy this whole bunch of code and just paste it over here but make sure that clicking on by clicking on show HTML this will be actually the code editor alright so you have to paste over here this is in the form of HTML and then after you can click here 
show editor and in this way the design would be modified all right then after you have to click on save so i have clicked on save and then after we can see its preview so you can see that we have the preview of this specific uh, track order latest page and here we have the description you can also modify this description and let's check this one as well so I have this track order number and I am going to paste it over here and let me click on track order. So you can see that same type of report I am going to see over here. So this product has been delivered in 7 days from United States and here we have the date and time and we have also the location, specific location. Alright, so in this way you can actually integrate the track order page onto your store. So let me tell you how you can change the color of this button and this border. So you have to go again here on pages and here you will be getting that specific track order latest page. You should click on that and here you need to click on this code HTML and down below you will be seeing that we have this uh, thing which is border color. All right. So you should replace this border color with the uh, other color maybe you can add here green for example and if you will scroll it a bit down we have input type button style background color is red so let me change it to green so let me save this page again and let me refresh this page so now you can see that the color has been changed now so if you are interested to add the uh, other color any other color so you can also do like that for example I have green and I am interested to keep it black so you can write here the hex code as well hash six times zero and I am also interested to change the border color that is also green for now and I am interested to keep it black so let me save this code and let's refresh this page once again so you can see that now the color has been changed that is black so in the same way you can modify the color according to your requirement so if you are interested to change the description you can also modify that description from here so you can see that enter your tracking number to see the order status so this is the description so you can modify the description as well so one last thing that I have is I need to add these track order page links on the uh, I mean on the navigation bar. So you can see that on the navigation we have home, catalog, blogs, contact and I am interested to add the tracking number over there as well. Man menu. So you should click on that and you should scroll it down and you should click on add menu item and here you need to write here track order then after you should select that specific page so i have two track order pages first one is track order so i'm going to add that one first of all and then after again i am going to add another track order uh, page which was the latest one and let me select that page as well so this one is the latest page and let me click on add so now i need to click on save and if you will refresh this page once again you will find out that we have two links track order and track order latest if you are clicking on track order then this page would be showing and if you are clicking on track order latest then you will be getting this specific page so that means we have successfully implemented the track order latest uh, code and you will be getting the link below in the description and once you are clicking on that you will be getting all the details of the code which I have saved onto my server. So you should use that code, paste it onto the uh, page and definitely it will work fine. If you are still facing any issue, feel free to ask me the questions in the comment section below. And uh, uh, in the coming videos, I will be uploading a lot of good content. So make sure that subscribe and like this. So thank you so much once again. See you in the next video.